here super easy guitar we're doing another Nirvana song because I keep on getting requests about Nirvana okay I know you guys love Nirvana I Nirvana I love Nirvana as well but you know guys so uh, Penny Royalty by Nirvana acoustic version in standard tuning because on the record it's E flat okay everything's tuned down so if you try and play along with the record you have to retune your guitar we're doing this in standard tuning guys Really easy, proper beginner's tune, this one. So, um, if you watch the MTV Unplugged, it's a little bit different to the one on the record. So, I'm just playing the one that is on the original record. Okay, uh, let's zoom in and have a look. Okay, so standard tuning, guys, starts off A minor. Know this rhythm by now. Down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. Don't forget when we're playing any A chord, you don't want to hit this bottom E string. I'm actually muting it over here. If you can't do that, just avoid it. Okay, down, down, up, up, down. It goes twice over to G. Same rhythm. this little lick he puts on that's pretty close to what he does okay so that's just on the bottom E string the sixth string the thick one two three two sorry two three oh and then you go down with that A minor straight back into the A minor let's do that again Funny thing on the MTV Live uh, Unplugged version, he goes A minor to G, then he goes to A major. Who knows? So, you know, whether it was a mistake or it's not on the original record, so he plays it differently live. That's fine. It's his song. He can do what he wants, right? Uh, so, just so you know, if it sounds a little bit different, it just goes to A major. But to be honest, if I'm playing this uh, live or whatever, I, I would skip out that A major. Just play the A minor G. on the record drums come in that doesn't happen on the MTV Unplugged because it's just acoustic version but you can see what chords he's using so he is playing C and D but he's kind of playing this power chord position because you could do them C still have to play a power chord position because or bar chord because then it goes to A sharp but what he's doing is C here power chord you can use the same uh, strumming pattern okay so all I'm doing there third fret on the A string the fifth string then I'm using my third finger to cover the D and G, all right? The other strings are just, they're just muted, okay? It's just something that happens naturally. Then we have to try and avoid this bottom E string. Okay, you can do it with a pinky if you can't bar it down like that. It works just as well, whatever you're comfortable with, okay? So that's C on the 3rd fret, move that whole position up to the 5th fret. Then we do the same 
position, this is A sharp here, so our first finger is going from 5 on the A string to 6 on the E string, the whole shape moves over. Now when I'm playing this on the acoustic, I find it sounds a little bit dull just playing the bottom three strings, so if you can change this into like a major shape, an E shape. Sounds pretty cool. Okay, so all I'm doing there, first finger on the bottom E, sixth fret, and then third finger on the A string on the eighth fret, pinky underneath it on the D, also on the eighth. Then my second finger is on the seventh fret on the G. Normally we play a bar chord like that, but we're not worried about those top two strings, just the bottom four strings. you can kind of hear it goes between six five six five six listen to the record guys remember always train this ear of yours that's how you uh, you won't need me to teach you lessons then okay or anyone else you'll be able to work it out yourself it goes like that okay goes between six and five. He, again, he doesn't do it on the unplugged version, so if you want to play it, play it. If you don't, don't worry about it. Straight back into A minor. end of that bar on the G. Down, down, up, up, down, up, down, 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 down. So just to kind of create a little crescendo before we get to the chorus, you go from this down, down, up, up, down, up. Down, 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 down. But as you, every time you do it, you just play it a little bit harder and a little bit harder. Slow it down at the end. So there you have it guys, Penny Royalty by Nirvana in standard tuning. Hope you've enjoyed this lesson. Please keep giving me the thumbs up. Please keep sending me the lovely comments you put below and the emails I keep getting with all the questions. I'll try to answer all of them. Some of them I even pick and do a video. Okay, so keep them coming in. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. I do these lessons every week and um, I'll see you again the same time next week. Enjoy guys. Thank you very much for your support.